fire, water, earth, and air. Welcome to Jamaica and Scorpio Tarot. Thank you for clicking in on your girl to see another one. What are the big signs you should keep trying with him? We're going to reveal the big signs. If you're going through a little mess, a little turbulence, a little toxicity, a little whatever it is that's going on, just having a little bit of problems, things aren't going as well as it was in the beginning, things seem to take a turn, the wheel is just rolling around and not stopping in your direction, in your favor, let's delve into it and find out what are the big things that will give you the signs that you should still stick around and stay and work it out and you know find your way through and get past that um, patch before i start fire water earth and air please subscribe to your girl i'm growing i'm at the bottom of the day trying to get up and i would appreciate you asking your favorite to subscribe also at the when we reach 1100 subscribers i'm going to give away 100 dollars. if you want to participate in that just subscribe comment win 100 and like the video so subscribe like the video and comment win 100 dollars so win one uh, dollar sign 100 okay and that's how you participate all right i already start taking down names of those who enter in the comments as a matter of fact i want to say a very special and warm welcome to every one of you fam that's been subscribing i see you as my extended family now man you guys are just making me smile each day thank you for joining the family thank you for taking a chance with your girl okay and for those of you who are new clicking in for the first time i won't disappoint you i upload every day give your girl a subscribe okay so oh i just i just mentioned the wheel of fortune not turning in your favor and here it comes the wheel of fortune so this is one of the big signs that you should stick around it's about to turn in your face i just spoke about it one of the big signs that you should stick around work it out tough it out a little bit try to have some communication focus and figure out how it's the wheel of fortune is ready to turn in your favor it's ready to give you your heart desires. It's ready to pros let all your prosperity and, and, and your money is coming in. Everything that's going wrong now that you're having issues and problems with is ready to turn around, ready to cycle through, ready to turn and just wash that off, right? So the dial is turning in your favor. Thank you, Angel Excel, for confirming that. Let's start off with this one. So... Let's find out some of the big um, signs, some big signs that you should keep going. Keep going and make it work. What are some of the big signs that you should stick around longer, make it work, tough it out a little bit. Sometimes things get a little turbulent and get a little rough and you want to stay and patch it up, make it work. Let us figure out what's going on here. Okay. I want about five more. What are some of the... Yeah, there you go. Oh my gosh. Okay. It's coming. It's coming. What are some of the big signs? That fire, water, earth, and air. Oh, there you go. Should stick around and make it work. All right, I want one more. One more, let me one more. One more. What are some of the signs that they should stick around and make it work? Some of the signs they should stick around and make it work. Oh, oh gosh. So a lot of you are going through some things here. It's, it's clear. So first of all, Queen of Cups. So Queen, one of your, some of you are in here, man, just going through it right now. You're feeling the pressure. You're feeling um, like you're trying hard and it's just not working out, but the wheel is there to turn in your favor. You're thinking about leaving right now, Queen. Empress, you're, you feel the pressure. It's hard. It's, it's, you're trying to tough it out and you're at the point of no return. You're like, yeah. 
and that is why you're getting this reading now to take it as a sign to stick around a little longer it's starting to get cold outside first of all um and if you're not being mentally abused or physically abused and it's just little things that you can work with you're just tired of it but you want to give it one last shot that kind of thing because i will never condone you sitting in a relationship that's just totally not working i will never condone you uh <laughs> watering dead grass because <laughs> they say the grass is greener where you water it not so much because if the grass is dead you could pour all the water in the world on it it's just dead dead mean dead so you water grass that has potential of fresh growth and if it does have potential of fresh growth uh, this is just saying you're going through a lot now tough it out a little because it's this is just one of those big signs that the wheel is turning in your favor your wish fulfillment coming through all of the, your manifestation coming through all of the help that you're asking god and the universe is just coming through to give you all that assistance right now and you're at that point of breakthrough because you're ready to go but the breakthrough is coming and the minute you go and that is why sometimes empresses and queens people are in relationships and the minute they leave the partner gets someone else and treat them like the world and you're like why you couldn't treat me like that no you they're treating the other person like because at that point in their life they just did not have that click they did not have that final click that cycle out the cycle that they were learning a lesson and the minute you leave they learned that lesson and now is able to take the lesson learned and pass it on to the, the new person in the relationship. While if you had stuck to it a little bit longer, you'd get that benefit that you've worked so hard for anyway, because you deserve that, right? But if it's turbulent and, you know, like feeling like category five hurricane, I do a shorts on the category five hurricane. If it feels like a category five hurricane in your relationship every day is so turbulent, it's painful and stuff. Yeah, get out. You get, take the boat. You can't even take an airplane. The boat won't go fast enough for that one. All right. Then you have the six of wands. Empresses and queens. Empresses and queens. If you, This is a big sign that you can stick to it a little more. Right? The person really want to work it out with you. They have expressed that. It's just that they're saying it. But they're actually not meeting it at that point. So that's a big sign. They're saying it. So they want to try. They have a heart, a goal, and want to try. It's just that every time they focus this in, the devil just come around and take the word and knock it out. And they do something different from what words came out of that mouth, right? So see if you can now um, turn that attention. Because it seems a wheel is turning in your favor. And the, um, the moon and the, the stars are aligning, <laughs> Right? um now is the right time to to stick to it a little bit because this person love you care for you admire you put you up on a pedestal just having a tough time whether it's at work or with family or with gossip or with whatever caused that issue and they're listening to other people listening to friends listening to family hear people whispering in the ear they're just not standing their own ground making their own decision and so that soon turn the, the you're going to wonder if it's the same person you're talking to or sleeping with. You're going to be like, oh my God, what a big change. The person is now going to be able to grow up and finally put their foot down and listen to their institution, make their decision and stop the caregiver. Bring, they, they just see there's a lot of distraction around them right now. So if you can hang it, that's a sign. And then here you go. If you're five of swords, if you're fighting right now, man, and it seems like it's a damn battlefield. And fighting not mean you're not boxing for one front like in a boxing ring. No, I just mean like words, just throwing insults at each other, being a little bit rude and disrespectful and out of sort and so on and acting out of character. And, you know, it, it's, uh, it's always rough when you can't communicate without getting into a fight or communicate where you express each other's... Um, um, perspective and each other accept that as it even if you have to agree to disagree so at this point just don't, don't try to win any arguments any fighting any just 
let them have the last word i did a video call um i was wrong listen to that it's just, i was wrong that's the, the name of the i was wrong sometimes just saying i am wrong i'm sorry and just be the peacemaker can make a whole big difference their heart it just changes your heart after a while because they realize you're done with fighting you're done with arguing you're done with trying to winning you're done with trying to be right all the time and that kind of bring about a change and that's about a, such a peace because you become so unbothered if they say something that is you know hurtful or pain like uh, you don't respond to it aggressively and you're not giving back the negative edge and they give the, after a while they're gonna be like wait mm they start to feel a little bit guilty because they realize that was a little nasty and uncalled for and that's the way queen respond that's the way empress respond hmm interesting i can take oh this one um page of wands they're still in love with you they still feel passion for you they still care for you they're not trying to use you or abuse you. It's just a situation, the time um, of the darn stars, the, the devil just messing with things you have no business messing with and just using people in ways that they're not, you know, and, and some people are susceptible to just more negative influences than good. But the wheel is turning. No matter what, man, this wheel is going to be such a big thing here. <sighs> This is a big deal. And then finally, the Nine of Swords. Big sign that you can hang in there a little bit is if you're going through so much right now, you're not even sleeping, you're not eating much, you're losing weight or possibly gaining weight because if you're stressed, you can either lose or gain because some people overeat when they are stressed and gain weight or under eat and so lose weight because they are so stressed they can't eat. So for different people, it works different ways so you're just losing sleep right now we are stressed you know you're feeling depressed you're feeling like you need someone to talk to so if you can get some form of um therapeutic um advice there are some therapists and um someone to just open up and talk with or a trusted family member or if you're in you know um church environment and circle where you can get a pastor or um some deacon or some church members or sisters or whatever to just talk to um you someone to just rely on to have a conversation to open up to or if you're your um private deeply private and just want private professional consultations and you don't want family or any other friend to know your business or whatever then you you try and um seek that um but you're hurting right now and so the decisions you're making to go is from a place of just sadness and hurt and pain um, you love the person still. The person has not done that past that um, that that ultimatum. Not they have not cheated and all of that. Not only it's not only cheating you can leave a relationship for because there's many other reasons, multitudes of reasons you can leave other than the person cheating. But I'm just saying there are certain things that um, you would have already left for, and that hasn't happened yet. But the stress of life and how things turn out and um, uh, third party involvements and um, little family and friends here and there and so on. This person is just really not focused at this point and not seeing things the way they need to see it clearly. So if you're just stressed out about that, try and talk to somebody. And then when things get back down to a calm where this clicks in, where this takes effect. Because this is coming and this is why this is here. Where this take effect, you can reap the benefit of this page of wands, the love, the passion, the care of the six of wands and take advantage of that. Because it's on, it's on either side. All the turmoil going in now is on either side. So it may come in and out. Now things go good, then it goes sour. Then it go good, then it goes sour. In and out, in and out. But it's coming where it's going to be stable for you. It's going to click. It's going to stay. Things going to work itself out. And then you're going to ask yourself, where, we, uh, well, how did we get there? Because we're here now and we're so happy and peaceful and comfortable. Understand each other, respect each other, and keep, come to a place where we um really, really uh, put aside all of that agitation and anger and stress because with the queen of cups here man you love the person they love you right so if that's something you want to work on 
fire, water, work, and air. This is what it's saying. So let me pull some love messages that your person want to send to your heart right now to just let you know they're thinking about you or what message they want um, you to know. So it helps guide you through this warm time you're going through right now. Wow. Angel itself, what messages? Or fire, water, or earth and air from their person that they're going through a little bit of tough patch with to help them decide if they should stick to it for a little longer to see if things will turn in their favor, to see if the wheel of fortune will take effect and turn in their favor and give them all the luck and fortune and blessings and goodness and happiness. There you go. All right, so this is what your person want to say. When I'm sad, I look to, oh, I knew it. Sadness is here all over it. When I'm sad, I look at your pictures and feel so much better. Sadness is just permeating this read. I mean, wow, I'm trying to tell you. I feel, I feel um, like I've known you all my life, yet you are so mysterious. Oh my gosh, that means the person is secretive. Um, well, mysterious doesn't necessarily mean secretive, but uh, yeah, <laughs> sometimes you can't figure this person out. And that's why you still love the person. You like that little intrigue and mystery, right? I'm a better person because of you. I feel more optimistic, optimistic and full of life. So see, you're saying because of this person, you have this optimism about you. So don't give up on it just yet. You can give up if you try and it just won't turn in your face. It just won't click for you because sometimes your actions and your behavior and the, your cause and effect is different from the other person that's in your life. Their timing is different from your timing. And remember, this read is for you. So it doesn't mean that their timing is going to work out but because this is working out in your favor, you know, the universe will align it with that person so that they can, you know, go with the flow of what's coming for you, what's meant for you. I'm so grateful I met you. You are, um, are you sure you are real? <laughs> so you see, they are kind of saying to you, I'm so glad you're sticking to me and coping with my bull crap right now. I know I'm giving a lot of it. They may have expressed that to you time and time again. I know I'm giving you some tough shit to deal with right now and I'm glad you're sticking to it because you know they're wondering if you're real because they know most people would have possibly walked out a long time ago most people would have most people would have probably walked out a long time ago <laughs> um I am what that is why I have to give you the messages as they come because my personal um way that I handle things is different because I'm an ice queen I'm quick to ice people out. I'm quick to turn away. I'm quick to say no. I'm quick to walk on from things that's negative and toxic. And that just does not work for me or in my favor or on my behalf or seem to be um, uh, uh, going right. So, yeah. So, um, um, yeah, I may have to take a list out of this book right here. All right, so fire, water, work, and earth and air, thank you for being here. Remember, subscribe to your girl. Please enter, win $100 in the comment if you want to enter to win the $100. So subscribe, like the video, share it if you can, I would appreciate that too. And enter, um, comment, win 100 If you don't want to participate, it's okay. Subscribe to your girl, I'm trying to grow and I just appreciate you being here and I am uploading every single day won't be a disappointment whoop, whoop, subscribe whoop, 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 subscribe whoop, whoop, subscribe subscribe whoop, whoop, subscribe subscribe whoop.